Fertility is the ability of a person being able to conceive a child. Many factors can affect fertility, including various diseases and age, but did you know that temperature can also affect fertility in males? Sperm count and sperm quality are important factors that affect male fertility. A healthy male should have a sperm count of about 15 million to over 200 million sperm per milliliter of semen. 15 million sperm per milliliter of semen or less is considered to be a low sperm count, which is a medical condition called oligospermia. No sperm count at all is a condition called azospermia. Nearly 50% of men dealing with infertility have low sperm counts as the primary factor, and this is considered to be the most common cause of infertility. One common factor that affects both sperm count and sperm quality is temperature. The optimal temperature for sperm is 33 degrees Celsius, which is 4 degrees lower than the body temperature. This is why the testicles, the site of sperm production, are located outside of the body. The testicles are attached to the cremaster muscle in the pelvic region. This muscle is able to pull the testicles closer to the body to maintain the optimal sperm temperature when the external environment is too cold. In contrast, this muscle is also able to relax, allowing the testicles to hang lower, further away from the body when the external environment is too warm. Testicle movement can help maintain the optimal temperature to a certain extent. But what happens to sperm count and quality when there is prolonged exposure to high temperatures that testicle movement can't control? Some studies have shown that climate can have an effect on sperm count and sperm quality. For instance, one study which collected semen samples from healthy Texan males found that there was a trend for higher sperm concentration during the winter months than during the summer months. Another study, which specifically looked at the differences in the quality of semen in outdoor workers during the summer and winter, found that there was a significant reduction during the summer in sperm concentration, total sperm count per ejaculate, and concentration of motile sperm. There are many factors that play a role in elevating the temperature around the testicles. Environmental factors such as the consistent wear of tight-fitting pants, the frequent use of hot tubs or saunas, and the prolonged placement of laptops directly on your lap can all lead to excessive heat in your groin area. Studies conducted on these factors have produced mixed results, however, with some stating that these factors can affect sperm count and quality, while others say they don't. Additionally, there are physiological factors in your body that can cause deviation from the optimal testicular temperature as well. These include having a high fever or having a high percentage of scrotal fat. However, the majority of unsafe heat exposure occurs in occupational situations. A case control study found that men exposed to heat because of their occupation were 1.8 times more likely to have morphologically abnormal sperm. They were also 1.8 times more likely to have been trying unsuccessfully to conceive for more than one year when compared to men who had not been occupationally exposed to heat. Studies have also shown that certain occupational groups have higher risk of infertility, which is thought to be related to prolonged increase in testicular heat exposure. These include occupational drivers, ceramic oven operators, and bakers. Occupational drivers are thought to be at greater risk of infertility because they endure long periods of sitting, which can increase testicular heat as the testicles are insulated by the thighs when you are in a sitting position. On the other hand, studies show that men who operate ceramic ovens or are bakers as their main occupation have abnormalities when it comes to their sperm quality. One study looked at the semen of oven operators and found that they contained significantly less motile sperm, around only 7% motile, when compared to normal levels of sperm motility. In general, higher temperature exposure may have effects on the fertility. However, depending on how high the temperature is and the length of exposure, different activities can have different effects on sperm quality. There is no need to panic, however, as these are circumstances that can be avoided with awareness or a change in lifestyle. To reduce the risk of negatively affecting sperm count and quality, it is important to take standing breaks if you are sitting for a prolonged period of time. As well, Wearing loose-fitting pants and underwear, such as boxers instead of tight briefs, can help prevent the testicles from being too close to the rest of the body and raising its temperature. If you have any questions or are concerned about fertility, it is a good idea to consult your doctor or local fertility clinic for more information. Thanks for watching!